because I, yeah. I, I think what, what it's about, what we're getting to, and, you know, just listening to our, our own organic um, rhythms, it's about, like, getting deeper into these elements and, and exploring um, these things that we already talked about. And that's just kind of how I opened up about, like, um, I, I always wanted, like, it was, like, on, for lack of a better word, my bucket list, right, uh, to really dig into the Mayan count. And just, like, having that as a practice, like, opened up other avenues or helped me, you know, explore and expand and, and bring a different widening uh, a lens, a different, like, uh, template and, and palette of colors. You know, when, when I think about my own um, artwork and my own practice, it's really the video editing I find this thing that I keep on, like, working at and I keep on practicing at it. Like, I... You know, I mean, it, it's much like I, I would, like you with the vacuum, like, it's my instrument. <laughs> and I keep, yeah, I keep oh, on, definitely. I keep on working at it and doing it because, like, I just know, like, uh, when I've combined it all together, that, like, that's, like, uh, my way to... Because it started off early on in Imaginarium, and, like, we're talking about art, but, like, can I make the whole thing, like, art? <laughs> and like that's a tall order yeah. but but like I can I keep striving <laughs> for that and I think you know you get this uh, good little uh, weird balance of it you know yeah that's what happens you know like you you have to do it <laughs> yeah you just have to do it and, I like, and it's, I it's, like the vi- yeah. video. No, just the videos and everything everyone's making it's, it's there's lots of things I could spend my day my conscious hours checking out you know it's it's nice to see stuff that like is inspiring and or like thought-provoking or brings me back to a place of mm-hmm. some sort of kind of like wholesome wholeness yeah. or like some sort of you know just awareness of a part of myself that is always there but like most things that is coming you know would come through the rectangles on the wall or the you know whatever rectangles in my pocket are glowing you know most things aren't really I mean I try to keep inspired sources but like I don't know it's it's nice uh, to have more uh, the more like raw inspired sources we're producing here I don't know if that really makes sense yeah. I just saying I appreciate the the videos and like it and uh, the musics and the just hearing like clips from the chats because it you know, it provokes something within us that's uh, a bit more positive spirit provoking than a lot of the options out there that are, yeah. you know, usually push certain algorithm that are trying to be fed to us. Uh, kind of have to, like, look into the circles that might have that inspiration so you can get it a bit easier than, uh, or to turn on the TV, you're not really going to get that. Yeah, you know, like, yeah. It was kind of interesting, too, because, like, um, I was hanging out with my friend earlier, and um, she brought her along her friend, and we we're, were smoking, and then they were talking about what I was going to do later, and I was mentioning this, and I'm always, like, don't like using the term podcast, but, like, for someone to, like, when I first, like, talk about, like, what I do, I, I use it, but then I'm always, like, oh, I don't like using that word. And so, like, as we talk about it, I was just like, uh, I forgot what she said. Oh, in the conversation, do you guys... I forgot how she said. She was like saying something like debate, but she wasn't using the word debate. Uh, you know, like if we think different than each other. And I'm like, we don't all think the same. But like the point is not like to have a debate yeah. or or have like tension. Is like, uh, then I, I go with like how we phrase it, right? Uh, shaking the pumpkin at Frog Pond. And I tell her about shaking the pumpkin is like referring to this, like setting this tone and like, Back in the day, the Native Americans would like shake this pumpkin, to, and the one person, just like what you were saying, the 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 call of crow or the crow song or whatever. There's like just like noises, <laughs> and it gets like into like this weird little groove, right? <laughs> and, yeah. and and it's like to 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 get us in that charged space, like what we were talking about earlier. Like there's all these like things, this noise uh, that and you know like there's like. You know, we, we even to get things like simplistic, so like, you know, we're overwhelmed and, and truncating stuff and truncating stuff. But then there's this whole other space, you know, that is charged. And, um, you know, uh, what, in my own phrasing, is called like the, the heartbeat of the universe, 
or even your your own heartbeat and um and stuff that I learned uh, when I was doing stuff with open mic night and one of one of our poets she said that poetry's blood on the floor and I always liked that and, uh, and then it, it, it's and I was like, it's about like getting to that place where, and I told her too, earlier on, I learned this in Imaginarium, where I didn't even like to tell people that I was like recording or even later to have like it framed as anything. It was just like, okay, all through the week, we're kind of like tossing things back and forth. And it's just about us getting excited. And then like wherever it goes from there. And it's actually more <laughs> interesting to see like where where all the, the live uh, threads I merge <laughs> when, yeah. when you're talking about things or, or you know whatever's going on so so it was it was funny to to try to like um explain to my friend's friend about um what i do you know i always had that like even like a long time ago I, when i was in the kitchen i remember this hey what are you gonna do on your days off because i like two days off and i was like oh nothing but in my head nothing meant like oh i'm gonna read I'm going to have like this crazy talk. I'm going to spend this time like doing video editing. So like when I said like nothing, like <laughs> nothing meant like, oh my God, I have the time to like fucking do all this, this like real stuff that I consider more, more real in, in a lot of senses than, than my work, my nine to five job. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. 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 But you know, like, in my case right now, I have this job and... I'm having a good time, honestly. Sweet. It's good people, you know, everyone's very kind and uh, they're trying to do things well. And yeah, yeah, I, I find good. it very, Fortunate. they're in transformational process, actually. And and yeah, I think they, they're becoming, uh, even though it's a global corporation, they are going in in a uh, at least as until I can see it's a good direction uh, you know like putting people first and you know trying to, to balance and uh, good and, and and also you know I'm dealing with with information about corporations from different places in Europe and all of that and it's it's moving there I, you know my eyes is like man it's you know everybody's going there okay let's change into green uh, stuff energy let's search for different new options and you know all of that it's it's coming and it's happening and uh, to be honest it makes me feel more positive about the future and about what we we could do, you know, like, and where this civilization can get. That, that reminds me, um, tomorrow I'm going to talk with, um, with Streamer D. But yeah, uh, we didn't really get into it, but um, things are not good in Turkey, uh, to say the least. But he, he's, he's doing his project, and I think that's something, you know, as we wrap things up... Um, we talk about ecosystems and, and, and building relationships and connections, expressions of peace. And even, um, uh, John, you were digging into, um, what do you call it, Daniel and... Um, Active Inference Institute. And, and doing um, just, just you know, can, whatever we're connecting to, too, I think what, what a part of like digging deeper is, is doing those notes. Um, when I was doing open mic night, I would do video edits for everybody who read a poem, right? And yeah, after a while, the act of like doing that, when I would read everybody's poem, I would hear their voice in my head. <laughs> 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 like the literal voice was like living inside my head as I read the poetry. <laughs> <laughs> But, you know, like listening and, oh. and, and writing and creating that feedback loop uh, and what we what we do, what I do in the video edits. And, and I think what we do, um, mixing that in and creating these mandalas or these collages and building on, t on top of these these things. Not only, you know, I think it, it helps to integrate like that kind of stuff within you, you know, as it becomes like this practice. I think that's like... Are you inviting us to... Uh 
make like visual mandalas for yeah. the edit. Oh, okay. Draw mandalas like every day. Yeah, cool. Right. <laughs> awesome. uh, I was thinking too um, of doing this thing with with Imaginarium because we have this function. It's called Superminds. And it, like basically, you send it to a channel, and you offer them tokens, and you said, "Oh, this and that." But I'm gonna create uh, the tiles because I have a bunch of tiles, and I have a lot of elements. And like, yeah. send the prompt of like, say for this this cycle, it would be Dream Eater, right, or Baku, uh, depending on who I'm sending it to. I basically know everybody within Imaginarium, <laughs> so so yeah. I'll, I'll I'll make it like edit it to them, and like do have some fun with it. But yeah, like um, building the tiles and building uh, mandalas or drawing them and, and sending elements to layer on top of, you know, the, the kind of like exquisite um, uh, visuals. Mm-hmm. Um, I mentioned this thing in, in the, the shared document, but it's it's the exquisite uh, corpse frequency project and exquisite audio, exquisite visuals and exquisite tiles. <laughs> so there's like different sections <laughs> oh. but like there's different yeah. things to play with and like you know like someone like uh eclipsing binary he's he's he would he, he does visuals too but he'll be good to toss some audio to you know like here yeah here's some elements and like play with it and here's like a theme dream eater or whatever right we'll see what he yeah. comes up with and, and stuff like that um i think is really yeah. um something to 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 hammer out a little bit more and uh, to start like you know building on top of that i think will be cool yeah i was i was thinking about the the fourth track on the album uh-huh. the guitars uh, the acoustic guitars and that that could be a remix you know like yeah totally. that track could be remix it yeah and john john's yeah. been doing on uh, hand drums right hmm? <laughs> Off and on, it's <laughs> had a religious moment once or twice with them. I used to feel like I couldn't do anything, but now the drums play me. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, okay. just uh, let me know what the prompt is. I still really like the idea to um, plan in like these three days segments. Like I'm, I'm trying to um, get something together for myself with that. Yeah, but, totally. Uh, yeah, I'm yeah. Just anybody, let me know if you want to uh, experiment with that. Because otherwise, I'll I, I'm down. I'll gear down for something that just I'm gonna um, reference. No, because um, I was thinking like that as, but it'll be a, a, for the for the prompts for like people on minds. It would. It, I'm just gonna make it like more simple about like just within the like the 13 cycle frame. Uh, like yeah, whatever, definitely. Whatever they do, but like for us here to create the elements, because like later, I, that's what I think maybe the video edit will be. We we work here on our own stuff, right? Because there's like stuff that I want to do more with the the Bakusan um, um, poem. And even <laughs> like create like weird music and be chanting and doing weird shit uh, <laughs> uh, to, to really bring it out um, would be fun. And I want to I want to explore this this cycle yeah, totally. Get crazy, get crazy. You have to do it. If you feel it, yeah, yeah. You know, especially you especially it. here in this Discord and with Imaginarium, but it's all about like exploring that fun and, and creating that space. Like with the, the latest video edit, it was about like um, that feeling you were saying it—the feeling when we were kids or whatever. Oh yeah, man. that's that's the best feeling, you know. Like, cool. Well, <clears throat> thanks everybody for making time for us. Um, we'll wrap things up, but in in that document, I have that a uh, uh, little tab for the exquisite uh, corpse frequency. Uh, maybe we'll make a whole different document on that, and we'll. we'll We'll start to have that there, so then we could build on top of that. Which uh, yeah, okay, cool. Yeah. Nice. Good night. Nice. Okay, bye. bye. bye.